the first of our championship fights. So let's make some noise. The next fight is for the Potter's Red Amateur Super Middleweight Championship. Introducing first, sign out the red corner, representing Vital Force MMA, Christian Zeller. Christian Zoller calls himself the Flow Master. Credits himself for being a multi dimensional fighter. Training out of Vital Force MMA, Lamont McCurry, his trainer. And he is excited to be here for this bout at the 172 pounds for that fighter's rep super middleweight title. Coming into the blue corner, we've got Joshua Caldwell representing Blackbeard Kickboxing. He's four and two, he is six feet tall. This is a super middleweight bout. And Joshua comes into his corner in grand fashion over the ring. The time has come to see who will be fighters rep, super middleweight champion. Five two minute rounds between Christian Zoller and Joshua Caldwell. The first of our two championship fights begins right now here on fighters rep number 14. Here we go. Zoller trying to use that push kick, establish the distance, goes with the leg kick. Caldwell with some nice straight punches. Caldwell with a two-piece combination. Fighting out that southpaw stance. Caldwell scoring very effectively on the range. Found his range right away, straight cross to the body. Hey. 
Punch comes a little bit low to Zoller. And again, in this situation, the fighter has up to five minutes to recover for that low blow. Zoller gets up, goes to the neutral corner. Our referee, Pong San, is giving Caldwell a warning about that low blow. And Caldwell goes right in for the action. Zoller. Keeping his footwork going. And now he's gonna rally with those punches to earn that respect back. Fighters engaged in a clinch. Our referee Pong San breaks them apart. 10 seconds in this first round. Zoller with a nice cross to the body and to the head to close this first round. Caldwell's really on his mark right now. He's finding his punches in. Christian Zoller down from a low blow, gets back up, rally back pretty strong. Still think the first round goes to Caldwell. John, what do you think? I think so. Caldwell came out strong other than that low punch. Uh, looked like things were going his direction. The momentum changed because of that stall because we're waiting for a recovery, but Caldwell looked good. Ready to go right on the, right on the notice of his opponent being ready. Zoller is going to have to land some heat to earn the respect from Joshua Caldwell. Joshua Caldwell is in the zone right now, scoring with the punch combinations. And he's going in right away. Strong kick. Zoller moving in, trying to close that distance. Caldwell, the nice high kick. Zoller reaches for the body, comes up short. And it seems like the flow master is finding his flow right now. But Caldwell reaches for those punches and finding those three pieces. Like to see a tighter guard from Zoller. Zoller's eaten quite a few hooks from Caldwell. And Zoller, like the Terminator, keeps marching forward.
Caldwell scoring with those hooks. Caldwell very effective to get those punches right after Zoller kicks. Lands those hands right away. I want to see Zoller with a tighter, tighter guard and a little bit more snap in his punch. Because Caldwell is right now, he is in the zone. He is in the zone. John, your thoughts? Caldwell laying it on heavy. He's connecting when he wants to and, and really devastating his opponent. You know what, there's a lot of toughness in his opponent, and uh, Christian Zoller, he just keeps coming. And he's eaten a lot tonight. Big left hooks, big kicks. So we'll see what happens. The winner called out by Raymond Martinez earlier, so we'll see what happens. Mm. Well, this is scheduled for five, this is number three. Zoller. You see Zoller now applying head movement, trying to weave and bob away from those punches, working out a little bit more effective for him. But Caldwell, he's got the snappier punches, and he's able to bring those punches back right away so he can throw those combinations. Yeah, it looks like Zoller's trying to change his angles, but Caldwell catches him. Zoller with the leg kicks, trying to change the rhythm up and down. I want to see Zoller sit down on those punches a little bit more. He's walking the punches, and he's punching while he's a little bit high on his stance. Caldwell's in the zone with those punches. Straight cross to the body by Caldwell. Caldwell with that sharp hook. And then still rallying with the punches. Zoller's got to keep those hands a little bit tighter. It seems like it's all Caldwell, but you know this is kickboxing action. One punch, one kick can change everything. And we know Fighter is here. Both have great corners. And each round is like a chess match. And we'll see what adjustments Lamont McCurry is going to make for Christian Zoller. And right in here in Fighters Rep, we go into the championship rounds. This is round number four, scheduled for five. This is for the Fighters Rep Super Middleweight title at 172 pounds. Christian Zoller wearing the red gloves, Joshua Caldwell. We're in the black gloves. Round number four. Our championship rounds. Caldwell with the straight cross right away. Zoller is slipping. He needs to throw the punch while he slips. Call was just finding that mark off that lead hook. Body kick, there you go. Body kick. Attention, he's having it. Oh! 
And hooked it head to the body from Caldwell. Same combination again. And it forces Zoller to take a knee. And that's it. Our referee, Pong Sanctorian, calls the bout. On the fourth round. Great effort, a great bout between both of these warriors, Christian Zoller versus Joshua Caldwell. Caldwell on fire with those hands, finding his mark every punch he threw and finishing off with that hook body combination twice in a row. Forces Christian Zoller to go down on his knee and our referee gave him a count and stops the bout. Tonight, the belt belongs to Joshua Caldwell. It is his night. John, how did you see the fight? Well, like you said, Joshua Caldwell, he's just incredible. He really used his hands. He had a big kick, got a big hook that he connected at will over and over again. Eventually, it looked like a nice liver punch at the end. Just put his opponent on his knee. It's the accumulation of those body shots. It may have been a low blow, but it seemed like Zoller lost a lot of snap very early in, in the fight. His punches were coming off a little bit pushy. Kicks were not having a lot of good return on him. You know, on paper, Christian Zoller has had two fights. So I like to see him back in the woodworks. I like to see him come back again, come back and challenge for another title as he gets more fights underneath his belt. But I've seen this man fight before. I've seen him flow. But tonight belongs to Joshua Caldwell, who found everything with those punches. He was digging deep. All right, I'm with your winner and now super middleweight champion, Joshua Caldwell. What a fight. Let's put down your performance, Joshua. Now, Joshua, I mean, you were moving and grooving and picking your shots. It was an amazing fight. Did this fight go the way that you planned for it? Yes. Kickboxing, the crew, we work hard. I mean, 
Everybody you see with me, this is not just my belt, this is, the, this is my team's belt. We came out here, we did this together. And, and, and before I go any further, I want y'all to know that I'm Joshua, the leader of the Lord. No man will stand against me. Any other days that I walk this land, no weapon formed against me shall prosper. All praises and all glory to my God. I'm, I'm, I walk in my purpose and I'm here as a walking testimony of what you can do when you have faith. 100% faith into your hard work, you know what I mean? Just January, I said I'd be champion. Now we're in June and I got this bill. So, yeah. There you go. Now, I know you have lots of friends and family here. Any last words you want to tell about as champion? Yeah, I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you to my brothers, Blackbeard, um, my team, all the people that came out to support, my girl, my daughters at home, uh, my family, God, George, for giving me this great opportunity to be the uh, fighters rep champion. And uh, just expect me to come back and do it again, baby. There you go. We can't wait for you to come back and do it again. Hold on a second. George got something to say. Guys, here at Fighters Rep, we don't manufacture champions. You earn it. The cream rises to the top here at Fighters Rep. Joshua Caldwell beat David Rivera. Then he beat Cameron Spencer. And today he went out against a very tough Christian Solo and earned that super middleweight title for his team. Give him a round of applause, please.